high-flying tragedy for the man who stole the show at the opening of the Olympics in England. He joined other daredevils in a leap from the mountains today, and it resulted in a fatal mistake. And ABC's Ryan Owens has that. He had the world holding its breath. Jumping from a helicopter dressed as James Bond and gliding with that Union Jack parachute right into Olympic Stadium in London during the opening ceremonies last year. But Daredevil Mark Sutton wore another kind of suit, a wing suit. And what people can do in them may be as dangerous as anything 007 ever did. Sutton even had his own YouTube channel to demonstrate how the suits allowed him to fly faster and maneuver around majestic mountains. But today, the 42-year-old leaped from a helicopter more than 10,000 feet above the Swiss Alps. Plunging at 150 miles an hour, he slammed into the side of a mountain, dying instantly. Investigators are now trying to figure out what went wrong. And I'll show you how it really works. Joby Ogwen has done similar jumps um, hundreds here, of times. Here he is gliding that, around the Matterhorn. Look closely and you see a plane flying by him. The people that are doing it accept the risk. And if you're doing this, it's because you dreamed of doing it. And if you die living your dream, then so be it. It's a sport that's undeniably cool, allowing humans to take flight, to thread an impossibly scary needle, like plunging through this hole in a Chinese cave. All with such precision, the best can hit a balloon this close to the ground. It's so thrilling because it looks so dangerous. Tonight, a deadly reminder, it really is. Ryan Owens, ABC News, Los Angeles.